For many years, an elephant and its caretaker maintained a strong rapport. The wild animal was slapped by the keeper one day, and everyone was shocked by his response. Elephant Femai was born in the jungle. He was born in a tropical rainforest, surrounded by exotic fauna, just like all other Thai elephants. His safety in the wild, however, could not be guaranteed. Unfortunately, elephants have been categorized as an endangered species in Thailand since 110088. They are the national animal of the country and are beloved by many. And yet, Femai wasn't safe. The population of elephants in Thailand has decreased significantly over the years. The biggest culprit of this sad fact is logging. This is when businesses cut down trees for profit. This activity may be benefiting people around the world, but it comes at the expense of animal lives. The damage caused to the rainforests in Thailand led to the loss of habitat, and so elephants struggle to survive. This is precisely why he was rescued by Sianguin Chile, who is better known by her nickname, Lek. Lek has made a name for herself among the conservationist community due to her contributions in helping wild elephants. A couple of decades ago, she founded the Southeast Asian organization Save Elephants Foundation. This foundation has a sanctuary called Elephant Nature Parks, which is situated in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Currently, the place provides protection for more than 70 wild elephants. Although the link might not seem obvious at first, elephants can be likened to dogs. Save Elephant Foundations is dedicated to assisting elephants by offering them a temporary home or rehabilitation programs much as dog rescue organizations. Despite their enormous size, elephants can nevertheless experience mental and emotional difficulties. Lek is one of many individuals who comprehends this about wild animals, and as a result, she devotes her entire being to caring for them. When she reflected on her love for the elephants in her sanctuary, Lek said, From my experience, some elephants are very shy. Some are funny. Some are serious. All of the elephants have different personalities. This is one of Lek's favorite things about the animals because they remind her of people. The special thing about Femai was that he was the first elephant that Lek's foundation saved. On the day that Lek first found Femai, the soon-to-be keeper knew that she was walking the right path by becoming a conservationist. As Lek first wrapped her arms around the baby elephant, an instant bond was formed. The two have been almost inseparable since then. Even though Lek has rescued countless elephants over the years, she will never forget the first time she was able to give a home to an endangered creature. That is why so many people found it shocking when Lek slapped Femai. In the bright hours before the moment occurred, nothing seemed out of the ordinary. Femai went about his usual routine of feeding and strolling around. As he grew older in the safe space, he developed a few friendships with the other rescued elephants. For most of the day, Lek was preoccupied with completing her duties as the leader of the sanctuary. There were several animals to care for and a lot of financial issues to sort out. Despite all the effort needed to run such an organization, Lek never complained about her job. Animals were more than just pets or pretty creatures to look at. To Lek, elephants had souls, just like humans. And so she felt as if she was completing her life mission by dedicating all her time to saving this endangered species. At the end of the day, Famai and Lek were reunited. It was still a hot summer day, and the air was humid. It would have been enough to make anyone a little irritated. Nevertheless, elephants have developed an ability to cool themselves off in hot weather. Areas such as Southeast Asia or Africa are considerably warm all year round, and yet elephants are able to live there comfortably. Lek felt only one emotion as she laid her eyes on her elephant friend. Can you guess what this emotion was? Lek was not irritated, nor was she tired. As the elephant keeper saw Femai waiting for her, she felt only happiness. It was a comfort to know that at the end of a long day, she would always have her dear friend to turn to. It was clear from the bright look in the elephant's eyes that he felt the same way. There were a few people in the area, and they stood quietly on the sides. They observed the pair, and some of them even took out their cameras. They began to take pictures and videos, believing the moment to be worth capturing forever. Even though these people had seen Lek and Femai interact before, it was always an astonishing sight to watch the large creature behave so sweetly with a tiny human. At first, Lek simply laid a hand on Femai. The keeper was stroking his trunk. Attentive to the creature's peaceful expression, it was clear that Femai was tired. But Lek knew that the big animal often struggled to fall asleep. 
Like a child, Famai sometimes seemed scared to sleep by himself. It was at this moment that Lek did something shocking. She slapped Famai. The smack, though, was light, and it was obvious that Famai was unharmed. However, those around them were astounded. Even though there was just one smack, it was enough to get everyone's attention. The elephant's response to the keeper's swat was astounding. The elephant dropped his massive body to the ground silently. Lek's hand stayed motionless, though. After a minute, Lek also fell to the ground. She positioned herself right beside the elephant and moved her head where her hand was, so that she was resting against Famai. The hand which had slapped the giant creature was now rubbing its trunk. The bystanders watched the scene in confusion and fascination. Lek began to sing. It was then that everyone finally understood what was going on between this keeper and her dearest elephant. Lek was helping Famai go to sleep. Slapping May seemed like an aggressive action, but in this context, it was a sign to indicate bedtime. Lek's melody was carried by the wind. Although the day had been hot, the temperature had begun to drop at nighttime. All that could be heard across the area was the cool, whooshing air and a beautiful tune. Not much research has been done on whether elephants truly respond to music, and yet, the sweet moment between Lek and Famai clearly demonstrates that music has more than just a pleasing effect. Lullabies can put an elephant to sleep just as easily as it can a baby. It turned out that this was not the first time Lek had slapped Famai, only the first time other people had caught it on camera. This is because Famai had been struggling with sleep for a long time, ever since he was a baby. Due to the fact that Lek was the primary carer for the elephant, she had spent several years trying to help him fall asleep. For a long time, figuring out how to get the large animal to rest had been a process of trial and error. Eventually, the keeper was able to establish a routine with the elephant. Lek would either slap Famai's body or gently hit him with a towel or cloth in order to get the animal ready for bedtime before lulling him to sleep with her melodic voice. Lek has saved countless lives over the years, and she continues to do great work for conservationism. Although the title of the organization suggests that wild elephants are their priority, Lek has rescued a variety of animals. In fact, the sanctuary can also be considered a safe place for other wild creatures, such as boars and buffaloes. Hundreds of domesticated animals such as cats and dogs have also been saved by Lex Foundation. Since the story of her first slapping, Famai went viral. The elephant keeper and her precious friend have had many more pictures and videos taken of them to capture their sweet relationship. There is a video circulating around the internet of Lek lightly hitting her elephant with a cloth or towel. People who are aware of the entire narrative comprehend how this is actually advantageous for Famai because this action is insufficient to cause the animal any harm. The relationship between this keeper and her elephant has only gotten stronger with time. What outcome did you anticipate from this tale? I'd love to hear your thoughts on the story, so please share them in the comments. I look forward to seeing you in another video.